Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Okami. Last time, we as we ascended Catcall Tower and met the f and met our next brush god, Kabagami, who gave us the power to climb walls. And whoa, oh crap! Now we're trying to get this treasure chest without falling off. A sun fragment, awesome! You obtained sun fragment. Click three of these bright fragments to extend solar energy by one unit. Ooh, we got another unit of solar energy. Awesome, guys. Well, you know, we just climbed this entire thing. I guess we have to climb back down, right? Wrong. Geronimo! This is the fun part. Woo, we fall down. Woo, this is kind of taking a while. When do we hit the ground? Oh, uh, and I'm pretty skilled. I landed on the trees and slid off the edge. <laughs> but yeah, that was Catcall Tower and the plunge back to the back to the ground. Um, that didn't work well. Let's try to climb this thing. But yeah, that was Catcall Tower. I hope you liked it. Crap. Ooh, actually, no. Not crap. Was, I didn't know there was a clover back here. Thank you, mistake of mine. Give me the clover. There we go. Ten praise bubbles. Blah, 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 blah. But yeah. That's actually one of my fa more favorite places, even though, like, it's com it's really weird and full of cats. <laughs> but it's, I think it's, I like, I like climbing up the edge of the big tower. I think it's, I think it's fun. Oh, we've got so much loot to get. Whoa, why'd my brush drag so fast? Usually it's a lot slower than that. Wow. Stray bead! Wow, we're getting a lot of these. That's nice. Nice to have a stray bead. Always nice to have. Actually, I want to see how many stray beads we have. We obviously don't have all of them, but I just want to check it out. Whoa, that's actually... That's actually not a lot of them. Okay, from like... This spot... From the newest one, like this one... Catcall Tower, 3 out of 3. These are like all the ones we've missed. Wow. Or I've missed. Ah, uh, it's okay. I'm not doing it to get the stray beads. I'm doing it to play the game. Show you how it goes. Have fun. Maybe I should go back and get the stray beads, though. Because I have I have gotten a lot of stray beads. I have never gotten every single stray bead in this game, though. Two praise bubbles. Blah, blah, I have never gotten every single stray bead in this game. So that would be pretty extremely cool if I did. But I do know what you get in the end. I'm not going to tell you, because that'd be like a major spoiler. But, yeah. Uh, let's continue going places. Now that we can climb wall... Actually, this is where, like, my knowledge of the game kicks in yet again. Because I, I almost forgot where we couldn't go. We actually need to go back to the island. We actually need to go back over to the uh, the coast over there. And we need to... Now that we can climb walls, there's a wall over there that we can climb. Oh, I'm sorry. Blah, blah, blah. I'm I'm Arca! It's basically stuff we've all, we already know. Hi-ho, Arca away! But yes, we need to go all the way back to the, uh, the, the land over here. Come on, Orca. Orca's actually pretty fast. He's like a speedboat. <laughs> wow, my sound effects are turning. Aren't that aren't the best? There we go. We made it. <laughs> we made it. Yay. But there's a wall over here. Back. Up. See, there's a cliffside by the sea, and we actually haven't been up there yet. Uh, oh, wait, are, are you guys bullying him again? Leave him alone, you freaks. Oh, Hiroshima, the great Hiroshima. What? You guys were being jerks to him, like, a second ago. Now you guys are all nice. What's going on? We were wrong, and you were right all along. What? Oh, Hiroshima, the great Hiroshima. You're so cool. It really was at the pier. Poor or Orca, I mean. We didn't believe him. But Urashima was telling the truth. Oh, Urashima, the great Urashima. You were wrong and you were right all along. Yeah, you bow down to him. Howdy there, Pooch. 
Y'all make it to the Dragon Palace? That whirlpool doesn't suck you to the bottom of the sea, huh? I'm happy as a pig and slop to hear y- y'all made it. Oh, we didn't. No, we didn't make it yet, Hiroshima. Sorry. I'll tell you when we do, though. Anyway, I reckon I'm in a bit of a pickle right now. I want to go and fish the sea, but these folks are in my way. Ah. Uh, I like kids, but they, those guys were being mean to me. That wasn't nice. Ugh. Oh, uh, let's... Yeah, let's fall in the water and swim over here. Uh, if I make... one, well, Okay, thank you. I was expecting the, uh... My makeshift raft to s float down the stream. Okay, but if you come over here, there is a wall back here that we couldn't climb until we got our power from Catcall Tower. Where is it? Actually, I think it's—I think it's actually back here with a cat. I'm pretty sure it might be a cat that's back here with it. Is there a cat? Oh no, I might have just been imagining that part. But oh wait, there's the cat. I like cats. Cats are cool. Clover. Ten praise moments. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, the cat went and played in the clover. That's so cute. Cuteness is overwhelming. My cuto meter is off the scales. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, can I have a demon fang? No. Nope. Six praise bubbles. Blah, 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 blah. This cat dishes stuff out. Oh, no, he's got buddies. He's got cat buddies. Okay. But yeah, this is a wall we need to climb previously. And in order to get into the Dragonian Palace, we need to climb up this wall. And there should be... Oh, these are some pretty cool ruins, actually. Um, hey, look, there's a dude over there. Let's go talk to him. What? What's going on? Oh, it's an enemy. I believe this guy's called a Cyclops. See, he's got like an... He's got one eye, but he's also got this big blue face. It's kind of weird. We're gonna take him down, though. Him and his big wings. Come here, Cyclops. Actually, I don't really know how to fight this guy. I don't really know a great strategy other than just punch him in the face multiple times. But we can burn him, though. He has spat his cane. He has, like, fire in his, uh... His... I don't... I forget what it's called. A pipe. Ooh, he... he what? He has a face! I thought that was his face, the big blue thing. No, he's got a blue... Her face underneath. Okay, buddy, come here. I'm gonna take your fire and burn you with it. That's what you get for. I don't know. That's what you get for doing stuff, being evil. You took him down. There we go. Big mean person. Big blue thing. That, was... that guy's kind of weird. We took him down though. He actually wasn't that bad. He was just really giant. It's a watcher. Huh? Someone there? Oh, who are you? Other than a watcher, I mean. Where are you watching? This is Watcher's Cape. It's said that the gods use this place to return to the heavens. At night, the place offered a great view of the starry, starry sky. Even the Whirlpool Galaxy was visual from the Cape's tip. Whirlpool Galaxy? Whirlpool Galaxy? Oh, I has got my thoughts. Cool. It's a group of stars. They form the shape of a great spiral, like a heavenly whirlpool. But since the demon-shaped island appeared on the sea, there are more and more monsters about, and the skies have dulled. The magnificent starry view can no longer be seen. You can't see the stars in the middle of the day, but when the night falls, I've got a wish to make upon a shooting star. If you wish upon a star, it always comes true. Even the whirlpool galaxy might appear in the sky again. Well, buddy, since we're a god, we're gonna- Oh, that's the sun. <laughs> uh, your wish ain't coming true soon. I'm screwing everything up. There we go. The moon and the sun are at the same time! Oh, wait, no, they do that. You can see the moon in the sky sometimes. Never mind. Well, it's nighttime now. I'm here in hope that I'll be able to make a wish. Shooting stars are rare now, not like before. <sighs> if only a star would shoot across the night sky, then I can make a wish upon it. If you wish upon a star, it always comes true. Even the Whirlpool Galaxy might appear in the sky again. Why don't you stand next to me and help me look for shooting stars? Oh, well, I will, buddy. I'll look for lots of shooting stars. Prepare to have your dreams come true, buddy. Make lots of wishes. Are you happy now? There, a shooting star! I've got to make my wish right now! Hmm. I wish that the sky was as magnificent as it was in the past. That the Whirlpool Galaxy was visible again. Oh, what's the... 
There it is! Hey, it's there! Th that's it! The Whirlpool Galaxy! My wish really did come true! 20 praise bubbles. Cool. That's the Whirlpool Galaxy. As you can see, it's very big and very spirally. And actually, if we come out to the end here... Ooh, it's really magnificent. Watcher's Cape! When the Whirlpool Galaxy spins in the distant heavens, a whirlpool shall appear... Uh, shall open up below. Amy, I have the feeling we'll be seeing the entrance real soon! Yep. Okay, we need to make the Whirlpool Galaxy spin in the sky, and then it will make the ocean spin. Wow, check out that Whirlpool Stars! It's like a huge windmill in the night sky! You say the Whirlpool Galaxy is the key to the Dragon Palace. If so, then the Whirlpool entrance should be somewhere under it. Hmm. The Draconian Palace must be in that patch of water. The sea looks pretty calm to me. And the Whirlpool Galaxy isn't even swirling! What do we gotta do to make that Whirlpool entrance appear? Well, Ishin, we need to do this. Let's come out here and... Oh, that's not how we're gonna do it. See, he said it was like a giant windmill, so let's spin it like a giant windmill. I think you're onto something. Maybe we're supposed to blow that starry whirlpool round and round. Try it again, Amy. Keep using that wind power of yours. We just gotta make the galaxy spin and spin. Eventually it goes very fast, as you can see. Spinning very rapidly around. And look, somehow it makes the water turn into a whirlpool. That's kind of cool. Look! The whirlpool entrance to the Dragon Palace. The whirlpool galaxy's bringing it to the surface. Okay, Amy, it's about time we got on down to that Dragon Palace. Let's go teach those Draconians a lesson. They're gonna pay for not keeping that water dragon on a leash. This was really dumb of me to do. Crap, um, I'm not sure if I'll be able to swim back, guys. Thankfully, we have the power of lily pad, so we might not die. Actually, I might be able to swim there. Let's actually, let's push it, let's push it, we can do it. We, no, we can't. I don't have faith, there we go. <laughs> now let's go get Orca. Orca, hopefully Orca will be able to, like, uh, take us to that big whirlpool in the middle of the ocean. This restaurant here, we can't interact with, the inter the restaurant we just passed. We can't interact with it yet. We'll need to take Orca out to an island in the sea. And there's a fisherman there that you can fish with. And eventually... Remember when we went back to Sa... Remember back in Sand City when we bought the marlin rod? That's what that's for. We catch a big marlin. Bullhorn, awesome. But yeah, you go out there and you catch a big marlin. And that's what you give to the restaurant. I forget what they give you in return. It might be a brush technique. So that might be worth going and getting later. Orca, let me on. Quick, come on. Right on, Orca? Yes. Hi-ho! Hi-yo! Orca away! Yes, we need to swim out to that giant whirlpool spinning in the ocean. Where is it? Right here? Oh, that's... That's not the whirlpool. That's the freaking water dragon. Get the... Get away! Oh my gosh! It scared the crap out of me! Ugh, that scared the daylights out of me. Wow. Uh, I didn't expect that. We better go fast. The water dragon's lurking out in the ocean here. Oh, that was that was scary. I didn't expect to see him here. I thought he went away when you when you got on Orca. No, he's still around. Ugh. Let's get down to that palace. Let's stay away from that guy. That guy's freaking us out trying to eat me while I'm in mid orca swim come on I love swimming on orca this is the dragon palace very pretty finally Yami we made it through that whirlpool down to the bottom of the sea this must be the dragon palace in the kingdom of the dragonians their leader Odahime controls the water dragon we'd better not let our guard down yep guys Ooh, that's cool looking. I like that. Uh, but anyway, welcome to the Dragon Palace. In the next episode, we will continue into the Dragon Palace. So, see you guys in the next episode of Let's Play Okami. Bye, guys.